okay then for the swimming pool kind of thing like you can go to site okay so go to site and you can able to go for massing and site and you can go for topo solid so create from sketch you can able to just to make something like this okay once you made it like you can also modify sub element i am just going to make this to 4 feet okay which is like this like we have like i told you na like you can go to in place mass in play ano uh, in place mass you can put the mass then you can able to go for uh, the particular uh, shape or whatever it is so if you have a swimming pool like this so you can just uh, go here and then uh, 3d view you can go to better okay so that we are going for a void so create the void form and you can see here the void how it came it went just downward what if you are putting like a uh, 3 feet and you can see here okay now you can go for a uh, create void form and then uh, finish uh, and we can what we can do means like uh, we can able to cut the geometry after finishing uh no no we should not put finish before like we need to cut the geometry so modify like you can go here cut geometry option see you have cut option na cut from here to here okay now you can finish it yeah we can finish it now you can see that kind of effect so where you can uh, fill uh, again another massing with uh, water this is how like you can create swimming pools and all go to massing and then uh, create from sketch now you can able to okay but this one like i am going for a uh, water so you can see here so how the water actually this is like uh, the water na ah okay i just selected the water now height offset i will put a uh, 3 feet now you can see the water it's uh, there inside the thing okay and if you want to modify the sub element you can just click here and you can put a only one something like this can you see how i made with the topo solid you can make such features swimming pool kind of thing and all okay